Back here at home, a beautiful day to be outside. KCON News Meteorologist Paul Deano is back with your next weather forecast and really a nice day out there. It is a nice day. It's very calm right now. The wind is going to pick up this afternoon, this evening, and it's going to be pretty windy in a few spots Friday and Saturday. But as of this moment for this afternoon, it should be pleasant and pleasantly cooler than the past couple days. A high wind watch is in effect for many mountain locations, northwestern L.A. County, including the mountains in and around the Santa Clarita Valley through the grapevine, all of eastern Ventura County, then south over the Santa Monica's into Malibu. We could see some wind gusts this weekend, Friday evening through Saturday afternoon of 45 to 60 miles per hour. And the surf has been kind of rough in Ventura County. This continues for one more day through tomorrow morning. So mainly this afternoon, waves running five to eight feet, high risk of rip currents at the beaches, uh, high uh, an above average risk of rip currents, even in Santa Monica. So if you're heading to the water, you should always be wise, but be especially wise with weather conditions like this. Long Beach, Partly sunny skies and 67 degrees outside. Fullerton, you're sitting at 68. Only 59 in San Bernardino because you didn't see the sunshine until about 1030. Temecula, 61. Santa Clarita, 64. Malibu, 64 degrees. We look live out at Long Beach and the Inland Empire forecast is featuring sunshine. Not that warm. Hitting the peak of about 66 or 67. You got a late start to the sunshine today. Burbank, you may hit 70 for a few minutes this afternoon. Notice how warm it was the past couple days compared to what we're going to get over the next few. The warmest we get between now and Saturday is 71. You will get afternoon sunshine, but the, the flow from the ocean is running pretty strong right now, courtesy of a strong ridge of high pressure centered to our south. If it's in this spot, we get a strong onshore flow. If it was to our north, we get the opposite. Probably still be talking about the 80s, but this is where it is and the onshore flow has returned. Let's talk about the wind. The wind was prevalent or will be prevalent this afternoon, but it's going to turn to more of an offshore wind by Friday and Saturday. That's going to keep the low cloud cover away in Ventura County and much of LA County. But look at Orange County and the Inland Empire. Low clouds again early Friday and we'll have a breeze at the lowest levels of the atmosphere down where we live coming from the ocean which will keep temperatures uh, pretty chilly. Your highs tomorrow, uh, once again, only in the upper 60s. I know that's not chilly in many locations in December, but for us, it's much cooler than we have been. But as soon as that onshore breeze goes away, look what happens again. We hop above average back into the 70s and likely will stay there for the majority of the next 10 days. So if you like it cool, you got today and tomorrow, upper 60s. If you'd like it a little bit warmer, we're back to the 70s by Saturday. L.A. making it as warm as 74 degrees on Sunday and Monday and still no rain for the month of December. Amy, back to you. Take part in the joy of giving by donating a gift to local children in need during the CBS KCAL Los Angeles and California Highway Patrol's Chips for Kids toy drive. Stop by one of our locations and donate a new unwrapped toy for a child or teen. Your donation stays in the neighborhood where you donate. Join us as we come together and support children across SoCal. Visit us at one of our drop-off events or text the word TOYS to 76278. Go to kcalnews.com slash chips for kids for a list of live broadcast locations. Driving in Southern California can be, well, you know, slow. KCAL traffic keeps you moving. With the where, when, and which way to go. Be prepared for now and what's next. Next traffic on KCAL News. CBS News Los Angeles. Your local news. Streaming wherever, whenever.